Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. <clears throat> and of course guys, today I'm going to show you how to use the WPS button on your Wi-Fi router. Now of course you might notice on some Wi-Fi routers, you may have two distinct buttons. One might say Wi-Fi and over here, this other one that says WPS. And the WPS here is just simply, WPS here stands for Wi-Fi Protected Setup. And it's just a simple means of allowing you to gain anybody access or grant anyone access to your Wi-Fi without needing to put in the password. Now, as you might know, passwords can be long and sometimes you do not remember them. For instance, you might have set up the um, your system or your Wi-Fi a long time ago and you do not remember the Wi-Fi. Do not worry as most modern devices such as this device over here, which is the Samsung Galaxy um, device but despite if you have a newer device such as a s8 s9 or note device or any other android should still work as they use the same basic setup so i'm going to show you how you can use the wps button but the first thing i want you to do guys is just go ahead and where you see your wi-fi setup just go into the settings for wi-fi you could go to settings wi-fi or you could just long press on the option as you see here, I have long press on the option. It should be off by default. But what you can do is as soon as you come in here, you'll notice that you have the option to turn on the Wi-Fi as well as more. Now, if I tap on more now, you're going to notice that there's only advanced and help up here. However, if I go ahead and turn on the Wi-Fi and just wait a bit, it should see the router. And that's this router over here. And what I'm going to do now, guys, is tap on more again. Once I tap on more, you'll notice here we have several um, options such as add network, WPS push button, WPS pin entry, advanced help. You're going to go to WPS push button, which is this button over here. So let's go ahead and do the push button. Notice it says tap the Wi-Fi protected setup button on your router. It may be called the WPS or contain this symbol, which is that symbol there. So what I'm going to do right here, guys, I'm just going to press this button. Do not just press and let go. Press at least for 10 seconds and just notice the other screen over there. I'm just going to press hold, then I'm going to let go. And I hold that roughly for about a few seconds, about five seconds or so. And you notice right here, it's showing you that, of course, it has connected to the network. And that was thanks to the WPS button. And there was no need to enter the password. If I forgot the password, it doesn't matter as it just let me in because of this simple setup button. So just go ahead and check your router. You might just have this button and you have never been using it. And it can work on other devices other than phones as well, as long as they have the feature integrated into the setup. And of course, as you can see here, I'm connected. And what I could do now is if I wanted to, I could go online and browse and so on. As you can see, I currently have um, internet access. All right, guys, so that has been how to use the WPS button on your router. If you have any questions, please leave them below. Leave them below. This is Ricardo from Blog Tech Tips. Bye until next time. Bye.